is the Kwon Four Morning News. Hello, everybody. Welcome to our two live hours of Kwon Four News Weekend. Could be a reprieve for some San Jose firefighters. We're gonna, they were pink slipped mm -hmm. an announcement expected this morning. Something to do with the change in the contract, possibly. Plus, high society meets high security at a former first daughter's wedding. We have a photo. Oh, we, have, oh. we do. <laughs> Top secret photo. By the way, I actually know the mother-in-law of Chelsea. Uh, and you still Marjorie, didn't get an invite. I did. Marjorie Margolis uh, uh -huh. married uh, okay. Ed Medvinsky, and she used to work at NBC in, um, uh, Washington. in Washington, D.C. with me. Oh, and right. my wife's a good friend of hers. We visited their house. We'll get them on the phone. Their conservatory was the size of our entire house, I might tell wow. you. <laughs> and inside now we know. From Henry. Nothing like <laughs> inside gossip. Yeah. Also, uh, overseas, uh, we're going to tell you about some of the worst flooding in Pakistan in the past 80 years. It's put thousands of people's lives in jeopardy. We'll have that for you. Also, an update on uh, news from the Gulf on the fishing ban there, so we'll have that as well. And we're going to be hanging eight, ladies and gentlemen. That's right. We've got Abby the Surf. Excuse me. We've got Abby the... No, don't sing. <laughs> we have Abby the Surfing Dog coming in. Of course we do. And we have amazing video of one of the gnarliest pooches <laughs> on the waves. Dude. Wait till you see wait, yeah, dude. <laughs> wait till you see what happens. Wow. But first, All maybe right. maybe we ought to see if it's good surfing weather. Oh, well, let's go on outside and I check was trying it to help. out. Check it out, dude. <laughs> Oh, not oh, right, no, not yet. No, you not could yet. actually, you could uh, surf on the, yeah, yeah. On the fog, <laughs> fog bank, fog bank. So this is downtown San Francisco. Hardly see some of it, but uh, that should lift, don't you think? I think so, but let's find out from the expert. Uh, Abby, where, no, <laughs> uh, Brian Van Aken has the weather. <laughs> 8.19 this Sunday morning. Let's turn it over now to Moondoggy Tenenbaum, who has a couple of friends. Hang ten. Hey. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> let me introduce you to Abby, the amazing surfing dog. That's right, Abby and her assistant, uh, Michael. Uh, Abby is a Chris, world champion Chris. surfing dog. Yes. Uh, I don't know, there's no competition for her, but we say she is. We will show you some amazing video and tell you why this rescue dog has just transformed her life and his life and maybe our lives. Coming up, Crime for News Weekend. <laughs> shot of a dog doing that it's not possible can a dog actually surf on its own come on this must be fake it isn't i guess not not only is it not fake we have the dog here to testify to the legitimacy of this video this is abby the surfing dog who lives in san diego uh, along with her assistant uh william oi did you say oi a wee. Wee. Uh, M Michael Wee. Uh, and uh, Michael's story about Abby the surfing dog really mm. is amazing because this is not like your dog that was born to surf. Could you explain how you and Abby got together and how this all came about? Sure. Oh, Abby, could, could we get you to like stay awake through the segment? Uh, Abby is real hyper, folks. <laughs> Go ahead. Please, Abby's Michael. a pretty chill dog. Yeah. <laughs> Abby was actually a throwaway when we uh, rescued her from the Humane Society of Silicon Valley um, who rescued her from uh, someone who had thrown her away. Wow. And so you adopted her. Adopted her. And uh, she had some problems. She was a very withdrawn dog, very scared. Only dog I know that was scared of squirrels. <laughs> would, would run the other way. <laughs> okay, so you figure this is a dog that needs some confidence. She, she needed a big confidence boost, and we found that, you know, dogs being athletic animals, the best thing to do is kind of bond with them through sports. So we tried all sorts Bonds of sports. Bond through sports. So they tried baseball, they tried football, cricket? they tried chess, <laughs> cricket. <laughs> but somehow you discovered... Uh, we discovered surfing. We've done a lot of running together, and I swim. Um, the surfboard was kind of a joke, and the first time you put her on it, she just stood up and <laughs> she rode it in. <laughs> so, I mean, did she, I, I'm assuming, there's, there's, she is working out. Um, I'm guessing that, like, you brought her on the board with you, and she kind of got the feel from it because you must be a pretty good surfer? Or? She jumped on the board herself. So we pushed it into the water thinking maybe she'd just bail on it and swim. <laughs> but she she caught it and she yeah, she loves to jump on things and Well I can see yeah. that. <laughs> so but I mean she must have learned some surfing from you, right? Um actually I don't surf real well. 
<laughs> well, watch carefully, because as you can see, she's picked a nice line here. And she's yeah. taking it in very nicely. Um, so what other sports does she, uh, does, she, does, she, does she practice? She's done paragliding. She's gone uh, downhill sledding with me, we mountain bike. She's figured out how to climb trees. And it's just an amazing dog, like a rescue dog that's full of surprises. Now, when she surfs, it, I know it looks like, well, big deal. She's just standing there, and the waves are pushing her. But actually, you were saying she really is using her skill in terms of moving backwards and forwards. And in fact, she's even learned how to cheat a little bit in terms of when she gets tired. She's, she's figured out that if you walk forward on the board, it uh, goes faster. So if the wave starts to catch her, she'll do that. Hey, hey good hey, morning. Hey, good morning. <laughs> That's right. I said wave. Uh -huh. um, and if she's tired, she'll sit back on the board, and uh, she knows how to pull out as well. Wow. That's and <laughs> she said, "You talking about me?" <laughs> she heard. So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is a feat that has rarely been seen on live television. Uh, maybe this could be a first, but we're going to actually watch Abby mount the board here. Uh, watch okay. carefully, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to do this one. Abby, off, off. All right, on your board. Don't nope, mm -hmm. shake. On your board. Up, up. Good girl. All right, and turn then, around. Oh, so, turn around. Oh, okay. Not so. Give me Which a kiss. Way? Good girl. All right. <laughs> so, um, oh, oh, good, good girl. So, uh, the lesson here, really, here, I mean, it's obviously cute uh, as the Dickens, uh, but uh, the real lesson here is, is about rescue dogs, which is why you happen to be in town. Yes. So talk to us a little about that. So, Abby was uh, is an alum from the Humane Society Silicon Valley. That's her alma mater. <laughs> and uh, we've come back to uh, support their annual uh, summer wine and music festival, which is a, a fundraiser for uh, this facility to help rescue animals. Right. Well, you were talking about how every rescue dog is is just all potential. You really don't know how they're going to turn out. Yeah, Abby, you know, she's an amazing dog because we've done a lot through sports, but all rescue dogs have... Cameras this way. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, go ahead. All rescue dogs have the potential to, to, I think, amaze and surprise people. And when you get a dog, you know, you shouldn't be discouraged if they need a little bit help mm -hmm. um, because, <clears throat> as you can see, they turn out to be amazing creatures. And, and Abby is just about as sweet and focused and relaxed a dog as I have has ever seen. She is just a sweetheart. <laughs> so uh, today you can meet Abby. I, is she bringing you along to this event? Yeah, she's bringing me to the event and okay. uh, I'll be helping her take pictures. Great. Uh, today, one to six Humane Society of Silicon Valley in Milpitas, big event, the Wine and Music Festival. For more details, you can go to hssv.org. Uh, and Abby, <laughs> you are the gnarliest dog ever. You know, I just feel like I'm using it. How would you describe Abby? Give me a little surfer lingo just to help me out here. Well, typically when we put her on the board and we uh, shoot down a wave, we just shout, uh, Bawabunga. Bawabunga, <laughs> we'll be back. <laughs> Cry for News Weekend. Bawabunga. <laughs> Every day.